Okay, all right, that took a little bit. All right, so once again, uh, plan today. We're taking out the Moss Deep Gym for sure. We're gonna do it. Um, we did a little bit of training last time. Uh, we were surfing around the area. We missed a lot of trainers, so I went back after the stream and I went back, caught a lot of trainers that I missed. So everything along the seaside big arch is uh, pretty much all knocked out for trainers. And we managed to get quite a few of our Pokemon back up to level, a really decent level. Um, we didn't do any real grinding. We literally literally just did our trainer battles. So I'm trying to avoid the grind. I'm not, I'm not, I don't want to fight some wild random ass wall Pokemon. So uh, we'll see how this, uh, we'll see how the battle goes. Uh, alternatively, what I did learn was, uh, I did find a TM for Focus Punch. So, if worse comes to worse, we can learn Focus Punch, and, uh, we can teach it to someone. Uh, other side note. Akron actually managed to learn Surf ever, si ever since he evolved, so we don't have to have a Cannon Fodder Meryl or anything, we can have Altaria in the party. Honestly, you might replace Altaria with a Flygon once we get a Flygon. I really do want Flygon in the party. I think it's a really cool Pokemon. But anyways... Let's, uh, let's give this a shot. Let's see, uh... Let's give this a shot. Let's see what these, uh... Let's see what these gym leaders can cook up with this double... With this double battle stuff. Let's show them what the rock is cooking, shall we? God, that's so good. That is so good. Then Sykes, thank you so much for the 16 months in a row subscription. You, madam, are single-handedly carrying Canada on your back. Thank you so much. Sam. But I agree, Sam. We should totally fucking change it to Altaria 44. We're gonna do it. Uh, we gotta go find the name guy. Was this the path? This was the path, right? This was the path. Oh, that was not the path. Let's see, did this puzzle reset? Yep, sure did. Great. Excuse me, pardon me, come through. Oh. One, two, three, and go. Alright. Fuck! Are you kidding me right now? The entire puzzle room's reset. Okay, fine. Everything reset. This is annoying. This is one of the more annoying puzzles in this freaking game. I thought the teleportation puzzle was annoying, but nah, it's totally this one. Uh, where was this? There we go. Okay, we gotta go purple, green, and we go back to the yellow room. Let's do this. Um, we've got a ground type up first, and we've got Zatu, right? So Zatu is not going to be affected by flying types. We're going to start off with Tropius to take out the ground type, and we're going to start off with Sableye to try and take out Zatu. So we're going to focus on the ground type dude first. So the ground type dude, actually start off with Agron and Tropius. Let's do Tropius and Agron. Tomorrow breakfast, we will be having cheesy eggs and toast with a fiber brownie, 
460 calories, 7 grams fiber, and 30 grams protein. That's pretty good. Altera baby. 44 Doge. That's pretty good. Um, okay. So there's two setups for this first round. I think Gardevoir could have could easily kill whatever the ground type was, but we're gonna go with Aggron just for the surf. So let's see what's uh, let's see what's up. Tropius and Aggron, first round, let's do it. We can do Surf and Razor Leaf to do double damage, and it's a ground type, so it should be weak to grass types and water types. So uh, let's see what we can do here. Don't care about Zatsu very much, I care about Clay Doll because of the freaking earthquake. So we just need to be need to be faster. Raise the special attack, special defense. Yep, gotta be careful with that psychic from Zatu. Shit. I was really hoping it was gonna do more than that. Come on, Agron. I believe in you, buddy. Shit. That's a lot of damage. We're gonna do a Hyper Potion, just so we can survive the next Earthquake, because I think it's gonna be another Earthquake. So I think we're gonna try and tank through these next two moves, hopefully, maybe. Hopefully it's not an Earthquake. There it is. Oh wait, it doesn't affect- okay, damn. Alright, so Eggron's down. Okay, we might need to start with Gardevoir instead. We can't play it all in Earthquake. I'll do Altaria. I got this guy first. Oh no. Alright, we had a Solar Beam coming. Now that Solar Beam is completely debatable. Nice. Fucking Paralysis. Perfect. Tropius. Damn it. Well, there's that. Just, just completely lost that, that entire solar beam. We got Sunny Day. Come on, Tropius. They gave us sunny day, we can get free solar beams. Let's go. Come on, come on, tr come on, Tropius. Come on, Tropius. Tropius needs to snap out of confusion. Eh. Thank you, Tropius. Do the thing. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself. Yes. Shit. Alright, this is our last round for, uh... Free solar beam. We're gonna heal Altaria. So we can survive the psychic. Alright, so what it seems like, it seems like one is a main damage dealer and the other one is like a debuffer and a protector. So we're just gonna keep focusing. Oh. 
Yeah, there you go. Even better. Actually, we're gonna try and sing Zatu Dude. God, how am I supposed to sleep with this riveting gameplay? Voltaire 44 height. <laughs> oh yeah, one shot. There you go. Tropius learning solar beam and sunny day. Let's go. It fucked. Alright, so we're gonna lose sunny day right here. This is okay. Damn it. Okay, we lost Altaria. That's unfortunate. It's okay, because we'll have... Let's go with Sableye on this one. Psychic time, let's do Shadow Ball. Oh, she... Yeah, that dude is just a buffer, but Psychic. Razor Leaf didn't do anything. It's definitely not a ground type. I don't know what the hell he is. Oh yeah, Sableye. Hell yeah, good job, man. There's the berry. I guess there's gonna be a hyper potion somewhere in there. Oh, alright, solar beam. Solar beam the shit out of him. Psychic rock. Psychic rock type? Okay, cool. I thought it was psychic. Alright, that's one. That's one down. Or that's three down. Hell yeah, easy. Easy clap. What? Our combination? Was shattered? It can't be helped, you won. So in recognition, in recognition, take this. Alex received the mind badge. Hell yeah. It's badge number seven, boys. The mind badge enhances the special attack and special defense of Pokemon. It also lets you use the HA Move Dive outside of battle. Oh, we're gonna get the HA Move Dive now? Let's go. Should also take this. That team four contains Calm Mind. It raises special attack and raises special defense. It's a move that's perfect for psychic Pokemon. Fog. Fucking fried him. Yeah. Fucking fried him. Look at that. All it took was Altaria and Tropius being flying type. So much smoother than last time. Oh yeah, significantly smoother. Like, uh, we, we wanted to go balls deep in with Agron just to tank shit, but, uh, yeah, it didn't work out. Earthquake is just way too strong. But, yeah, once we nullified that Earthquake with Tropius and Altaria, it was easy. Easy. And they fucked up with Sunny Day. As soon as they cast Sunny Day, it was game over. They weren't even close. So, there's the space station, or the, uh, yeah, the space center here, and Steven was there, and he said to go check out the town first, so we're gonna go, uh, we're gonna go back. Maybe we can see some of that Team Magma drama, because according to, uh, according to some of the NPCs, there's been drama for- Oh, shit! Uh, okay, there's a Team Magma drama right there. Oh crap, they're gonna do stuff. We gotta go. We gotta go. Alright, who's uh... Who's starting us off here? Trope? Yeah, Trope. Let's go. Yeah, so they came to... They came to steal some of the rocket fuel from these guys. And uh... We gotta stop them.
easy. Starting off with your drop card. I like it. <laughs> hey man, he's a... Uh... He's up there. He's one of the higher players at the party. Look at this. We're not fucking around here. Team Magma, you wanna fuck with us? Like, nah, you're gonna get... You're gonna get... You're gonna get the horns, man. Or in this case, the wings, or whatever. And at this point, someone's gotta get a good, healthy XP level up spike. Everyone's around 41, 42, so... Oh, no. Oh, I thought it was going to use Ember. Oh, these guys have no idea what's happening to them right now. Absolutely no freaking idea. The rocket fuel the Space Center has in storage, that's what we're after. We mean to take every last bit of it. Team Magma. Oh shit. Tropius is doing great. GG's Tropius. Hello. Our leader said no one, but no one gets past me. Okay, buddy. Get magma. Give this guy a shot. I'll give him one turn. We'll give him one turn. How's this guy at level 26? Everybody else has had 31s. How is he the last line of defense? I, I gave you a free turn, buddy. Should be tanky. Oh yeah, there it is. I didn't think Body Slam was gonna one-shot him, but it was worth a shot. Alright, let's see. Everybody's about to level up, so I think we'll swap it out. Come here, boy. I'm so proud. <laughs> That's right, look at this team. This team is sexy, ain't it? Look at that team. Oh, Terry is like blocking half of Gardevoir over there. Look, I'm just saying, if Watson could see us now, he'd be running scared. He'd be like, nah, dude, nah, dude. <laughs> oh shit. What's wrong with you? You're outnumbered three to one, but you still want to take us on? Yes. A reckless go getter, are you? Okay, I'll go first. Team Magma. Just fight me 3v1, dude. Let's have a triple battle. I'm not here. Okay. I'll take a turn to charge turn to charge up. Without Sceptile here, this team looks amazing. <laughs> I still feel bad for Sceptile. I gotta, I gotta check out his moveset. Maybe he learned something really good. Technically, the Leaf Blade is really good, but uh, that's his ultimate technique. It's just kind of not worth it. Did 
Just wait till we get Flygun in here. Flygun's gonna replace someone, I just don't know who it's gonna be. It might be Sableye, it might be Altaria. But everybody else is staying in. I'm just not sure which one of those two I'm gonna replace. Sableye's been clutching us, been been there with us since the beginning, so I don't know who will replace Sableye. Altaria still not super impressive, but not unimpressive. I think it will be Altaria 44. <laughs> I think I think so too, Bagel. I think it'll be Altaria. Replace the dragon type with another dragon type. But who knows when we find Flygon? I have no idea where Flygon is, so we gotta we gotta encounter it somewhere first. Oh man, and the paralysis. Mmm. Look at that. Mmm. Alright, Choke, no worries. We'll swap you out, buddy. Let's go, camera. You're so mad, bud. You're angry. You want to get that level, don't you? I know you do. I bet you want to take a break, but I won't let you do that. Right. Yeah, I'm the one that needs a break. Sure. Yeah. I'm the one that's, uh, that's having trouble breathing here. That's totally me. Mm -hmm. Yep. Totally. I don't give me a break, please. I don't... I don't deserve it. Holy shit. Flygon is the move. Dude can learn so many fucking moves. Can he? I just wanted him because he looked really cool. I saw him in the Pokemon anime, I'm like, I want that. <laughs> uh, awesome. Cool. Yeah, I, I, I'm thinking like Flygon is the Dragonite of this, uh, this version or something. So, uh, but yeah, cool. I look forward to getting him if we do get him. I would take Magmo. Team Magma wants to steal oh, our rocket fuel in the first place. I don't know, Mr. Scientist. Team Magma, do they want to? I don't know what they want to do with it, but Steven's down here. Hey, Steven. Oh shit. Steven's, uh. Team Magma. What's the point of stealing rocket fuel? Foo 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 foo. Since you're so curious, you deserve an explanation. We're going to jettison the entire load at the Mount Chimney. What? That's fucking insane. They're gonna put rocket fuel in the Mount Chimney? With Grudon gone, we have no need for that slag heap of a mountain. So we'll use the fuel's power to make the volcano erupt. It will be savage. Alex, you're gonna help me? Let's go into battle together. Are you ready? Oh yeah, bud. Let's do this. Uh, who's gonna go in there? You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna send our boy. Up first. Uh, Apparently, he can learn earthquake and flamethrower. He can learn earthquake and flamethrower. Good God! All right, this is gonna be our yeah. We're gonna do a doubles battle with Steven, Team Magma. Ah, uh, so you know what this means, Matang? I think we were boss in Metagross. If Metagross is in this generation? I didn't know that. Okay, so Flygon is the Dragonite of this gen. That's cool. That's good to know. Uh, there's... There, oh shit, they have a camera up too. So there's a Pokemon that I found that I really want to capture, but when I went to the area, I couldn't find it. So um, there's a waterfall. I wonder if it's on the top part of that waterfall. Uh, okay, so let's fucking let's uh, let's fucking do this. 
Confuse him. Yeah. Don't confuse me. Confuse him. Earthquake, but I don't know if a Tang will survive it. Oh yeah, look at camera up. He's just taking taking those hits, but. Steven to do something. I need to use an earthquake, but I can't because his fucking thing will probably faint. Strength, Rock Smash, Rock Tomb, Secret Power, Facade. Fire Blast, Sandstorm, Flamethrower. Yeah, now that's a Dragon type for ya. Fucking Dragon types are awesome. They learn so many awesome moves. First image I sent you are moves he can learn by leveling up. The next two are TM moves. Sand Tomb, Crunch, Dragon Breath, Screech. Man, I was really hoping there would be a Dragon Rush, but maybe that's in the, in the, in the later games. Crunch, Faith Attack. That's pretty good. I might have to actually, uh, if I capture one, maybe I'll, uh, read it so I can capture one from level one and put it in my box for future games. Because I'm thinking Flygon's going to be one of those late game captures that you get, which is unfortunate, kind of like Dragonair or Dragonite and stuff like that, or Tyranitar. It's not that post game, which is unfortunate. Bro, literally all of us are just tanking hits. Like me and the Tang are just tanking hits left and right. Like, uh, how are these guys not dead? I need Steven to switch to his stupid Skarmory. He's got a Skarmory in there. If I can use Earthquake. This would have been done a long time ago if I could, could have just used Earthquake. No, take out the tank. Don't take out mine. Alright. Alright, fine. We'll do. We'll Oh my god, get one shot, son. Oh, yeah. you're gonna be annoyed. Why? Why am I going to be annoyed? Because this mighty Yenna? Yeah. Getting Flygon is very easy. You just have to go into the desert, or the Mirage Tower, if you didn't get your fossil. Now walk around, and you'll face a Trapinch. Catch and train it until LD. 35, it evolves into a Bravo. At LD. 45 your Bravo will evolve into a Flygon. This is what happens when you don't know the evolutions. This is what happens.
son of a bitch. This could have solved a lot of our problems. Alright, well, whatever. I guess we're gonna go back and capture it. Honestly, I didn't even remember that. Uh, so, so there's an NPC out there that talked about the Mirage Tower, but we, we never found it, so I don't know what the actual trigger was. I always thought there was going to be a side quest taking us to it. Uh, but yeah, the Mirage Tower, I'm, I bet it only appears on certain days or at night or some shit like that. I don't know. They should start at the highest levels, right? E. What just are the highest levels? I'm not sure. Um, but I've seen several Chapinches before, so... Uh, so here's the thing. In the anime, you catch a Flygon in a Sandstorm. When I saw the Sandstorm, I thought we were going to find a Flygon in there. Oh, yeah, I guess so. No, actually, that's going to be like around level 16, level 20, something like that. So, in the anime, the Flygon is in a sandstorm, so when I saw the sandstorm, I thought, Oh shit, we're gonna find a Flygon! But, I never found it. I didn't fuck. I didn't know Flygon was an evolved form. I thought Flygon was like... Was like Skarmory or something. It's like, that's the only form it has, or like Tropius. I thought Flygon was just that. Just itself, and that was it. I didn't know it had different forms. So, fuck me. Alright. I'm with our leader. Okay, well, we beat these leaders, so... Alright, we're gonna go catch that guy after this. We failed to make the volcano erupt. We failed to control Grudon after we had awoken. Is our goal to expand the land misguided? If... If we, Team Magma, are wrong, then might Team Aqua's goal to expand the sea also be equally misguided? Alright, we will give up on the fuel. There appear to be more important matters that I must examine. Phew. That was too intense, Alex. Thank you. I have something to give you as so thank you for your support. Just come see me at home after this. I only knew the Bravo evolves into Flygon. I completely forgot about Tropinch. Ah, it's okay. Oh yes, I don't live in Rustboro City. I live right here on this island. Well, that's okay. Alright, well, we live and learn. When I play the remakes, I know exactly what I'm gonna do, so... We still have one badge in the Elite Four, so we can still find use for it. Damn. We could have had Trapinch been using that instead of uh, Swablu or Altaria. Share will go crazy. My god. We could have had we could have had him in that slot. In Altaria slot. Damn. So let's go see Steven in his house. I think his house is in the northwest. Uh, I think it's over here. I think I remember a kid saying something about- or- there he is. Alex, as you can see, there's not much here, but this is my home. Thank you for all that you've done. This is my token of appreciation. It's the Hidden Machine Dive. No need to be shy, you've earned this HM. So can you use Pokemon in this game in the next gen? Alex put away the HM. Wait. While you're using Surf, you should notice dark patches of water. Use Dive if you come to deep water like it. You'll drive you'll drop to the seafloor. When you want to come back up, use Dive again. In some places it won't be possible for you to surface though. Cool, thanks. Apparently there's an underwater cavern between Moss Deep and Sutopolis. You know, the one that Captain Stern found in his submarine. Cool. Alright, so I guess we kind of know how to get to the next area, right? Um, but before that, let's go catch that Trapinch. This, I think this is where we'll cut our main key story stuff right today. We want to go catch Trapinch, and I want to go check out the abandoned ship. So those are the two places I want to do. When you stream, I will always look up the evolution chains of all Pokemon. <laughs> uh, so, Sandstorm, Rustboro City, Rustboro City, Rustboro. Is it north of Rustboro? Where's the sandstorm? It's over here, right? This is it. Urban Turf Lava Ridge? Yeah, it's right here. Uh, I don't know, Bagel. I, I, I think some you can. Maybe some you can't. I'm not sure. 
because at some point there was generations where Pokemon just didn't transfer over anymore. Um, so I'd have to find out. It's one and two shared. Um, I think some Pokemon can beat in three, but not all of them. I think four was a whole new reset. I don't know. It has some weird rules about it. But that's my plan. Anything I don't use or use in my final team here, I'll probably transfer to the next one like I did with my Dragonite. That came from Gen 1, Gen 1, so even if we don't use our Flygon here enough, we'll probably transfer it to Gen 4 or whatever. Or try to. We'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll put it somewhere. We'll find a place. No big deal. I'm uh, not too concerned about it. So, alright, so let's go check this out. Sandstorm. Well, let's see who can learn Dive, first of all. No one can learn Dive. Absolutely no one. That's a rip. So let's, uh, let's go over here. There should be a tower made of sand around here somewhere, but for some reason it cannot it can be sometimes and sometimes not. That's why I call it the Mirage Tower. See? So let's see if we can find a trip engine here. Actually, let's just make sure. area. <laughs> That's right, get out of here, Sancho. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> so, but apparently Trapinch is all throughout here, so, uh, we can probably go a little bit north. It's a Trapinch. Easy. Uh, not easy, because everything I have is going to kill it. Fuck. Shit. Everything I have is going to kill this thing. I should have thought of that. our chances and just try and use an Ultra Ball. Once that will still probably kill it. Yeah, we'll try and use the same. Master Ball. Master Ball! <laughs> uh, Alright. Maybe we'll use our Master Ball, yeah.
try a couple of Ultra Balls first before we use our Master Ball. Easy. Let's go. Do that. Easy dub. Alright, let's go to let's go back to Mosty. Oh yeah, we were gonna go we're gonna go try and do the diving thing. Yep, it's diving time. Agreed. We're gonna go EXP share. By the way, I, ca I did catch a sword. I caught a sword the other day. I was doing some training. Your paint was going to be able to learn dive. Alright, Sfeel is level 32, so uh, at least he's semi high. Uh, we're going to move, we're going to trade him with Camera Up, just because Camera Up, we're still in water areas, so. so much. Oh damn, this guy has some good attacks. Ice attacks. Hailstorm, Aurora Beam. to the abandoned ship. And on the next one, we will uh, we'll go to Sutopolis, which is the next city. Wow, we have a lot of money. We have 80,000 Poké Dollars. that Mirage Tower though, that uh, seems pretty neat if we can find it. I just don't know where to, how to activate it. There's got to be an NPC somewhere that knows how to activate it.
have to use an item finder? What the hell? <laughs> yeah, same here, Bagel. I was... So when I was trying to think of... During the last stream, when I had that, that surf problem, I was like, fuck, this sucks. And then... As soon as I, as I was looking through a list of Pokemon that can learn Surf, I saw Aggron, and I'm like, Aggron? Aggron? And then I remembered that Rhydon can learn Surf, and Rhydon can learn a bunch of stuff. I'm like, no way. But yeah. Now, Eren, it's, it's freaking Middle Evolution, can learn shit, and then uh, there goes Aggron. He's just like, yeah, I'll learn Surf, sure, why not? Dude, there's nothing here. Like, what the, what the H? There's absolutely nothing here. Can we dive through these holes? Like, what's, uh, what's, what's the deal? Oh, that light section. Is there a light section over here? Oh, there is. Right here. We can dive back up. Comes by a pedal. Sure, I'll swim. Why not? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly it. No, I can't go through these doors. This is bullshit. Yeah, they make things evolve, you're right. Yep. So, Waterstone will do like Vaporeon, Firestone will do Flareon. I just don't know what else. I probably have to find. I have to pr find out which other Pokemon can use these stones, because I don't know which Pokemon in this gen can use them. So, one, two, three. From six key, uh, awesome. One here. Trash. That's trash. Too. Room six. The luxury ball. Okay. I think that increases friendship. If I remember right. There's one around here. That's trash. Damn it, that's trash. That's trash. Two key, let's go. Let's see, this should be that thing that Science 2 was looking for. Yes, the scanner. Let's go. Let's see what we get for it. Did we get something good. Can you 
use that here? I can't use that here? Oh, am I not in the actual square thing? Diving? Oh, yeah, there we go. Base Pokemon Eevee, Vaporeon, Shelter, Cloister, Staryu, Starmie, Poliwar, Poliwrath, Lombre, and Ludicolo. Poister, Star Use, Army. Polyworld to Polyrath. Oh, yeah, that's right. Polyworld to Polyrath. Yeah. Ah, it's okay. I mean, we didn't get a water stone until literally right now, so. <laughs> a biggie. I would like to get a star me though. I've never actually had a star me before ever. Uh, let's see, let's go find this professor dude. Are you up here? Hey, right here. Hey bro, I find your scanner. Oh, that's a scanner. Listen, can I get you to deliver that to Captain Stern? I want to investigate this ship a little more. Good sure thing. Can I just fly from here? I can't use that here. That's bull war, I'm on top of the ship. Let's go get deliver this to Captain Stern. He's in. Is he in Slateport City? I'm all been saying. Slateport City? Yeah, Slateport. Yeah, he's in Slateport. Uh, he's gotta be down here in his lab. In the museum. Let's try the ship harbor place first. Uh, I don't think Captain Cern is here. <laughs> oh, thanks for telling me that. Yeah. I... <laughs> Alex, it's been too long. Oh, Mr. Briney. Hey, since I met you, this old sea dog's been feeling frisky, so I decided to help Doc made it make a ferry. Aye, after all, the ferry would be able to carry a lot of people, but you know, that Doc is really something special. With his knack for technology and my experience, I'm sure that we can build one great ship. Aye. Hey, Mr. Briney's here. Where's Captain Stern? Literally just looking for Captain Stern. He's gotta be at the museum then, right? He's gotta be at the harbor place. Oh. Oh, I don't want to enter. Where's the, uh, where's the harbor? Oh, it's right here. He's gotta be in here. Oh, Alex, that item you have. That's a scanner. That would sure help us on our explorations. Alex, would you trade your scanner for something? Like, say, a deep sea tooth or a deep sea scale? <laughs> Shit. Uh. One of these turned into a Pokemon, right? Now, which Pokemon do they turn into? Tooth sounds cooler than a scale does. But I'm gonna go with the tooth. Yes. I hope that wasn't a mistake. Thanks, Alex. This will help our research a lot. So, what do we do with the tooth? Uh, I don't think we take it to the fossil maniac. But we can try. Let's 
Shit, let's inspect it real quick. It's a key item for sure, right? Nope. Hold item that raises a special attack of clam pearl. Oh, never mind. It's just a hold item. Fuck me. So this type of held item introduced in Generation 3. It allows clam pearl to evolve into Huntail and also boosts a special attack of clam pearl. Which really holds it. Well, I guess that's going in the box. Because I don't have that Pokemon. I'll have to investigate what, what Pokemon that is, because I have no idea which one that is. Possible Waterstone, too. Try and get to Sutopolis tonight, and then once we get to Sutopolis, I think we'll just uh, probably call it there. What's this kid doing? Around Mossy, you can see a wild whalemer. It's called, uh, what was it now? Wait, wait, wait. Whalemer Watch. Actually, so there, I found this old man in a cave, and he just uh, he just wants stuff. So, I think we can pick up stuff daily, so we're gonna go do that real quick. Just, uh, the game clock isn't working. Yeah, it doesn't work. Fuck me. Alright. That's a rip. Alright, I don't know what that old man gives, but, uh, might have been useful. Shell ball? That's all he's gonna do? Okay, never mind. That's a pass. I don't need to do that. I'm okay with not having that. Alright, let's go to Tsutopolis and see if we can get there. Level 9? Seriously? Fate your pinch can take that on its own. Thank you, Bagel. Give me the research I need to make informed decisions. I need some higher level Pokemon here. These are pathetic. I suppose. Oh my god. Alright, so by the way, this Trapinch that we caught has a hasty nature, so it's got plus speed minus defense, so this is gonna be a one fast boy. He is speed. Oh, there's a thing right here. What happens if we dive here? Oh, we can come up the other side. Across the rocks. What? Oh, crap. I 
interesting stuff. So there's even more places to explore around here. Oh yeah, he's gonna have all of the movement. This is gonna be one. This is gonna be the best boy we've ever had. You think you could dive anywhere, but you know, that's just me. Right. And these Pokemon are not cutting it for XP, so we're just gonna repel. Instead of trying to figure out where we're going, this should uh, just take us to where we need to go, question mark? Oh look, cave. Oh shit, submarine. Submarine Explorer 1 is painted on the hull. This is the submarine Team Aqua stole in Slateport. Team Aqua must have gone ashore here. Oh, shit! Alright, we found Team Aqua drama. Um, shit. It's gonna be 10. Alright. Fuck it. We're gonna do a Team Aqua drama. Screw the next city, we're gonna te do Team Aqua drama. Let's go, let's go foil Team Aqua's whatever plan is. Let's freaking go. Strength. All right, so I guess we're not doing Team Aqua Drama. This is why I hate it. HMs. HMs are annoying. Uh, actually, can Sfeel learn Strength? Sfeel can learn Strength. Yes, Sfeel can learn it. Poggers. Sorry, Sfeel. We're gonna be HM fodder, buddy. Go Swarb, yeah. Can he learn Rock Smash too? He can! He can learn Rock Smash! Uh yeah, but Camera already has it. I don't wanna I don't wanna put it on trip pinch. He doesn't have to. Have to have it, you know what I'm saying? Absorb. Look at him. Level 32. Now that's Pokemon we can level on. Let's go right here. Get around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Team Aqua. Sorb's Final Evolution. Oh, is that guy? That's Sorb's Final Evolution? That looks pretty cool. I think, I think he looks a lot more adorable as an orb, though. Sorb. 
sort of its multi-purpose. And yes, he, he does look more adorable. Yeah. He must stay in work. Uh, let's get this cave. Oh shit. Okay, maybe we'll go up here. That seems like a big puzzle, so let's see what this guy has to say first. Future sight. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Let's see. 80 and 90? Why would I want to use this? I have psychic. Psychic hits more. I'm not gonna learn it. I like my I like my setup right now. I guess it'd be good if like you did protect or something, where you flashed a lot, and then you did future sight to do a swap out. Alright, so let's see. Uh, Aaron's the next one, or not Aaron, Agron's the next one to level up, so we should probably swap him in. strength puzzle for a second, just because it didn't make sense to me. Oh yeah, we'll push this. That, break this. I thought it was going to be a Geodude. Why would a Zubat be in there? What are these Pokemon doing in an underground sea cavern? Like, no joke. Zubat. I get it. But I don't. Uh, that's a cliff. I don't want to jump off that... I'm gonna jump off this ledge then. Hello, yes. They've evolved to suit their environment. Yes, uh, that's that's the only explanation, right? Even these Zubat have evolved to suit their environment. Definitely didn't evolve into gold, that, that's for sure.
Yes, one damage. Let's go. Necron hurts itself more than anybody else does. This will be a good, uh, this is a pretty decent leveling spot. Granted, it's all freaking Zubat and stuff, but... Uh... What's crazy to me is that Agron is actually faster than Tropius. Doesn't make any sense to me. I was just here. Damn it. They got trapped in the water levels rose, and since they were already adapted to living only in a cave, nothing much changed. I guess you're right, yeah. That's a good that's a good way to put it. Good sorb, you're so fucking strong. Yep, it's true. He's uh he's but not these blue and these boulders it's getting a real workout. I don't remember if there was an actual NPC that told us about where the submarine was. We just happened to just dive and just check things out. I wasn't planning on actually diving down there. for trip inch so I, I was I was debating on doing the, the repel just so we can get past the story arc but it's just a waste of good XP so I'll just leave it as it is hmm which one do I go to left or right actually it's, it's this one son of a bitch So this is just all one big circle. Okay. Yes, team. <laughs> yeah, those are the guys you beat already. Okay, so there's this side. What's on the other side? Let's go, sword. Do your thing, buddy. Just use this side first, see what happens. Okay, no, they both take me here. Okay, so this one will go here. It takes me in a big circle. I go here. This so let's we can go right this one. Don't want shit. Sword versus roar, who wins? Oh, this water effect always makes my eyes cross. Uh yeah, there's that there's that one section after the next town. And uh yeah, that one gets crazy confusing. 
Like the entire area is literally just these pathways. Like no standing room whatsoever. Let's see, one, two. I don't want to take this one. No, that would get. This one does nothing. This one takes me back, so let's take this one. This one does a loop the loop, right? Yeah, this is where we want. Alright, perfect. That's what we want. Jesus Christ! Is this the other puzzle side? Yep. Yeah, the Zubat? You talking about the Zubat? Yeah. Uh, okay. So... Push up. And down. To the side. Push up. And down. And up again. That was fucking pointless. You telling me I could have just fought these dudes? Sharpedo is so cool. I want to catch one of those. Ah. Oh, I literally just typed out take that seriously. <laughs> I thought you were serious, because the first one, uh, I mean the first two were right, like right, left, right, then I would turn left, and then I would push the one that's up, so you technically you were right. No, I forget, Psychic doesn't affect Mighty Anna either, some of it. Actively throwing right here. just at four Pokemon right now. Oh my god. To be fair, Hagrid should not have missed those two attacks or whatever he was running. And he's confused, so... Sword, look at him. He's fucking tanking that shit. It wasn't supposed to be used for battle. This is ridiculous.
Dude, these guys are just picking on Sorb so hard. These ass guys are gonna be the only damage. It's really just literally gonna kill myself with confusion. Stupid? Yeah. Status, status effects are just annoying. Deeds. But... Scary face make you go slower. You would expect if anything it would make you go faster, you know, the whole fight or flight response. <laughs> uh I don't know. It's like maybe it's maybe you're so scared that you're shocked in place that you can't move. Like, I don't know. That's the only thing I can think of. scared in place, so... That's what I'm talking about, or Iron Tail the fuck out of him. Here I am again, overthinking a Pokemon game that's over a decade old, I'll tear it, won't you force it? Four levels for your pinch. Bad, not bad so far. Mother. to the side, can't move that to the side. Fuck. Oh, Alright, that wasn't it. Not a 
think that was it either. Fuck. It's those fucking blockers on the end. Fuck me. Let's see how far we can go. Ah! We push that to the side. Okay, I got it. Somebody else want to learn Earthquake? One of the best moves in the damn game. Because we have a free Earthquake here. Oh shit! Bro, it's Kyogre! Just a random Zubat chilling under a rock. Dude, Kyogre's right there. Shit, hold it right there. I was about to heal. Foo foo foo, so it was you after all. Behold, see how beautiful it is, the sleeping form of the ancient Pokemon Kyogre. I have waited so long for this day to come. It's surprising me how have you how you managed to chase me here, but that's all over now. For the realization of my dream, you must disappear now. See it your pinch one? Oh yeah! See it your pinch one. Aces is out, so uh, you gotta make up for it. I believe in you. Just because camera up is ain't here doesn't mean you can't do it. Okay, we're using Iron Tail. Takedown is not doing a damn thing. Up to area 44, yawn. Ah, oh, shit. Alright, we use a, we use a mud slap on this one. Want to save our TP for, uh, or PP for, uh... Dude, take down three points of damage. Let's go. Go, Agron. Alright, we're gonna use Sableye. He's gonna be about to get a level 2, so. Oh, and perfect. It's a Zubat, so we can use Shockwave. Super effective, don't lie to me, game. Shit, yeah, that wasn't very effective now, was it? Egrin's just gonna hit himself. Hell yeah, buddy. Dude, Agron is a fucking tank. Yes, he is, isn't he? These guys are insane. 
Alright, so, so here, I'm gonna tell you. Alright, so check this out. Uh, Tropius has 88 defense. Sableye has 77 defense. Gardevoir has 66 defense. Agron has 167 defense. <laughs> <laughs> he has 167 defense, 100 plus points more than everybody else. This guy is a living, breathing tank. I gotta go check camera up, but it's nowhere near close, if I remember right. I think camera up has like a little bit over 100. If anything, high 90s. Yeah, he's a chonky tank, hell yeah. And he's got the highest attack too. Like for this guy, physical moves is where it's at. Oh, Tripage learned Sand Tomb. Okay. Yeah. Charpedo? Nah. Keep Sableye in. And once again, he's. He's fat. He's the second fastest on the team. Gardevoir is right now is the fastest. Actually, I think Altaria is the fastest. I don't know. I, I gotta go check all the stats. I gotta go check Altaria and Camera up, but um, yeah, he's a he's a boy. He's in there. Dude's the whole package. He, that's that's why I like him. He's a uh, he's pretty badass. He's he he hardcore reminds me of Nato King, like a fucking tank. He can run anything. Foo 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 foo. I commend you. I must recognize that you are truly gifted. But I have this in my possession, with this red orb, I can make Kyogre. The red orb suddenly began shining by itself. Sure. Oh no. What? I didn't do anything. Why did the red orb... Where did Kyogre go? Hmm? It's a message from our members outside. Yes? What is it? Hmm. It's raining heavily? Good. That should have happened. This is why we awakened Kyogre. To realize Team Aqua's vision of expanding the sea. What? It's raining far harder than we envisioned? You're in danger? That can't be. That's just not possible. Hold your position and monitor, monitor the situation. There's something wrong. The red orb is supposed to awaken and control Kyogre. But why? Why did Kyogre disappear? Why? Oh shit, here's Magma. Maxi, what have you wrought? Archie, you've, you've finally awoken Kyogre, haven't you? What will happen to the world if this downpour continues for all eternity? The world's landmass will drown in the deepening sea. What? what Don't get all high and mighty with me. Wasn't it you, Team Magma, that infuriated Grudon? So as long as I have this red orb, I should be able to control Kyogre. I should be able to control it. We don't have the time to argue about it here. Get outside and see for yourself. See if what you've wrought is the world that we desired. Alex, come on. You have to get out of here too. What happened? What is this wretched scene? Did I make a horrible mistake? I I only wanted... Do you understand now, Archie? Do you finally see how disastrous your dream turned out to be? We have to hurry. We have to do something before the situation goes completely out of control. Alex, don't say anything. I know that I have no right to be critical of Archie, but the way things are now, I doubt that we humans will be capable of doing anything about it. But neither can we stand by and just watch helplessly. The responsibility for putting an end to this falls to Archie and me. This defies belief. Those super ancient Pokemon. Their power is unbelievable. They've upset the balance of nature. Alex! Alex, what's happening? This is terrible. After the scorching heat wave ended, this deluge began. If this doesn't stop all of Hoenn, no. The whole world will drown. This huge rain cloud is spreading from above Sutopolis. What in the world is taking place there? There's no point arguing here. Sutopolis might provide answers. 
Alex, I don't know what you intend to do, but don't do anything reckless. Okay, I'm going to Sotopolis. Oh, shh. Nikes, dude. Nidoking. Nidoking that decided to go to a medieval reenactment. Ekron can. <laughs> oh, yeah. You mean Ekron? Yeah. Oh, boy. Shit. Not now, Tentacool. Or Wingle. Whatever you are. gone to Sotopolis on my own, and uh, we probably would have found absolutely nothing there if we hadn't done a freaking dive. Not now, Wingold, damn it. Alright, I'm gonna put in a repel, because these guys are not very strong, so... Almost not worth it. Look at these guys just swimming in the freaking storm. Evergrand City. What is Evergrand City? Where the heck is Utopolis? Oh, Utopolis is over here. Damn it. Went the wrong way. I think we're gonna leave that story beat for the next time because it's already gonna be 10 30 and i'm not sure how long this story beat's gonna last so i think we'll leave that for next time uh shit i really want to get this Utabo, so and you know what i think i'll do some offline leveling at your pinch just a little bit and uh just get him a little bit higher for next time yeah big excite for the next one we got some we got some content going. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be super it's gonna be super fun. And who knows, maybe badge eight after? Who knows? I don't know. But anyways. Alright. I'll check y'all later. Have a good night everyone. Peace out.